This is the Look Great Naked Cooking Show, and I'm your host, Nathan Chase Plummer. I will share with you my own healthy gourmet recipes straight from the Look Great Naked Cookbook series. These recipes require minimal prep time and are sure to impress your friends. We will also provide you with the macronutrients to keep you informed on what's going into your body. Along with the freshest ingredients, we will help you pick the healthiest options. Join us each week as we provide you with the tools to look great naked. Hey guys, and we're back at the Look Great Naked Cooking Show. Yes, we are. <laughs> I've got Kwai has joined me again for a new episode. We're making the Look Great Naked Frozen Yogurt Cupcakes. Can I just say something really quick? I, I would love it if you did. This book literally takes your game, and I can I can say this because it's true. Because you've got game. Um, well, this is up to my game. Now naked, I would say I'm like a scale <laughs> of an eight. Okay, that was pushing it seven by following these recipes. 9.8. Before I would say I'm about a two. Like dark, dark lights, and now I'm like, leave the lights on. So we thought, hey, let's do let's do page 69 today. Jumping straight into the 69, we've got our ingredients <laughs> here. Okay, so since I'm a very professional cooker, I'm going to tell you what to do. Okay. You, you tell me and I will grab it. So the first ingredient one is Greek yogurt, one and a half cups. But um, Here we've divided it into three quarter cups because we're going to do two different flavors. So okay. same amount. But why the Greek? Why not the Yoplait or the other yogurts that Yo, are? Yoplait. Oh, Yoplait. Chobonne. Chobonne. <laughs> like what is? Actually, what is, and they all do have a Greek version. So the Greek has double the protein Ooh. and typically has less calories. So oh. if you are eating to maintain your macros, Greek yogurt is always the go-to. And then we use a vanilla as our base, and then we're gonna make it better. So then now we have the second ingredient is two tablespoons of honey. Yes, we got that here. And we've mentioned before, raw honey is the best, left, less pasteurized, and it's more natural. And if you're going to have sugar, it's better to have a natural sugar versus a non-natural sugar. So it's like aspartame versus the good stuff. Fun fact, aspartame converts to a mild kind of formaldehyde when your body processes it. So if you're gonna drink a soda pop, it's always better to drink the real sugar soda instead of the diet, because the diet has aspartame and that converts to... We also need peanut butter. Peanut butter. And as we've mentioned on previous shows, the all natural peanut butter is the best. You wanna turn it around and look at the label. Turn it and around. And you want peanuts to be the main ingredient. Sometimes a little bit of salt's okay, but any added oils you don't want, if it's hydronated, hydro... Hydroplaned. Hydronated. Hyd Hy hydroplaning, Hy like if it's wet outside, you don't wanna do any of that. Like go mm -hmm. slow on things. Well, first of all, so there's granola. Oh yes, and one the granola cup. typically comes in larger chunks. Ooh, I love chunks. So I was hoping that you could help me out. Yes, I can. I'll put that over there. And we need to just make it smaller. Do you have any ideas on how we could do that? No, because I usually like things bigger. <laughs> um, but I'm willing to change things up today. So how do I make it well, smaller? If you like, I just happen to have this. Baby. And what do I do with this? You beat the hell out of the bag. First, wind up. Wait, really? I, okay, wait, do, okay. We want, come on. Well, I don't know what, will it break? You, you hit like a girl. And girls can fucking hit. Whoa. I love this, this is like, get your aggression out. The guy that broke my heart does not approach me, but like, keep on going. Yeah. Or this or this or that. Someone picks me off and just pick it off and I want to kill the granola. It's uh, is, that, <laughs> is that small enough? This is probably the best granola tenderizing I've ever seen. 
I'm actually in great shape because I've been eating all the recipes from Looking Great. Nate's amazing. Look Great Naked oh, Cooking Show. Looking Great. What did I say? Look Great? It says Look Great. Looking. I said it right. It says Looking. Sorry, Look Great. I actually have been doing all these recipes and soon She's my dairy pretty, air. So adverbs aren't. You know, aren't my okay. thing. They aren't. It's <laughs> true. I, I'm supporting that. No offense taken. Now, what are we doing? All right, we are gonna throw this concoction together. Ooh. And fun fact, halfway through making this, I almost enjoy more than the final product. Mm. Okay, okay, so you're gonna help me. We need one Ooh. cup of the pulverized granola. The pulverized, which means you beat the fuck out of it. I'm having issues. Oh, here, look, teamwork. Teamwork. No makes fingers. Dreamwork. Four fingers, whatever Nate says. How many fingers? Let's start with two, and then we just sprinkle. Love your ambition. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now that we have a cup of granola. We are going to add two tablespoons of peanut butter. Oh, I love peanut butter. The all natural good stuff. All natural good stuff. And the good stuff is typically the stuff you see sitting on the shelf. The oil is floating above the well, peanut butter. That's, that's a good. Good tip right there, folks. Get the peanut butter with the oils floating on the top. Fun fact, you can, actually, the naked truth. Ooh. You can put a blender, one of the blades on, not a blender, a mixer, Ooh. and just put that in the peanut butter and it'll mix it all back together. Because typically it's been on the shelf so it just separates. All right guys, then we're getting our honey boo boo. Honey boo boo. And then we're gonna drizzle it. Ooh. You just, oh, yeah, that's nice. I don't drizzle honey as well as you do, I tried. You, you do, you did. I believe in you. But is this gonna be hard to mix? Well, you're gonna be able to tell me in about <sighs> 10 seconds. You're making me do all the work. And like, you're, like, you're gonna have to like get that like, tricep in there. Maybe like some bicep. Do I? Yeah. No, you're doing good. <laughs> Okay, but you have like a fancy. And you know what? Just because this is for us, and like we're not really worried about calories right now, because we're just loving ourselves, we're gonna add a little more of that. As a binding agent, you guys, I'm thinking of binding, not necessarily the calories. Just take a bite of that. This is are where we, I like to stop sometimes. Okay, are we reusing this spoon? Do we have another one? We've got. We, this is a cooking show. We have gaggles. This is, I would eat this like right now. Yeah. This is delicious. So if she likes it now, folks, just wait. And this is a fun food for your kids. Cause then you can get it stuck in your teeth. No, my, my dog can't have any of this. <laughs> <laughs> you know, well, that smell the peanut butter thing from all, oh. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. I just Girl, wait. focus. Put some berries in your bowl. Wait, but why berries? Why not pineapple? Why not all the other stuff? Do I do the whole berry? Mm-hmm. Half. Mm. Plop. Plop. I'll do a little more. That's good. Okay. Well, all we're doing here is we're just trying to give the yogurt some color and texture. So we are just going to mash up the blackberries and the raspberries. And berries have the... Oh, I mash them? Yeah, oh, we, want, we want it to like bleed. Oh, so we want to actually give, okay, so look at the before. Yours is already going blue. On other cooking shows, they probably use food dye, but we're all about that natural, healthy life. Because we want to look great naked. I don't need red number 17 in my arteries. Which should be illegal. Next to all my bacon grease. Yeah, I like bacon. You know, I love bacon. Okay. Oh wait, you might need some more. I think that one's harder to get. I milked my blackberries prior. You milked it? Yeah. Okay. You can milk anything with milk, actually. Hmm. I learned that on Meet the Parents, by the way. Mom. Okay, so, so you, I'm getting it. It's going like pinkish. Oh, yeah. And that one won't go as colorful because blackberries are more pigment, you know? So, you guys, I am just doing a little bit of this into each. And we're going about halfway once we're done. Okay. This is gonna be the base oh, of our so good. little cupcake concoction. I almost here. feel that would be a good facial. It's exfoliating. The granola or the yogurt? All of it together. 
Well, this, oh yeah, we this like would explode. like slap it on and then lick it off our faces. You think my dog has a dirty tongue? Okay, now you get three of these. Oh, there's a little bit left. Mm. <laughs> you guys, right. legit the Wait, best part. Wait, it's so good. Mmm, a mess. Mmm, lick it. Mmm, that is so darn good. Okay, now we're gonna do dollops. You get three and I get three. Mmm, that is so good. I'm just basking. I'm gonna let you do that while I soak in the goodness. <laughs> Okay. This part gets dangerous. So we go like the oopsie dazzles. Okay, so. And you guys, just... this kind of gets the texture of ice cream. So it's like ice cream with a crunch. Sometimes if you have a little extra because you're screwing around like we were, you just eat it. And do you want to just make sure all the granola is covered? Is that how you kind of tell yeah. if it's. And we'll done? do a slam bam and it'll just fill in all oh, the holes. Okay, I want to see the slam bam. Wham bam, slam bam, thank you. And then you just get the little pretties like you can do on I want to make it look like a nice little nip. Oh, what would you call that then? A nip? Ooh, that's a Pokemon. <laughs> We're going to nip in a Pokemon. Poke your mom. Pokemon. And so, now we pound it. Oh yeah, the Wham Bam. The Wham Bam. So you just drop it a few Ooh, times. look at it. Wow, wiggle jiggle. And if you're lucky, you do not lose any thickness and pokiness. Oh, is that a bad thing? That, I was just showing you what a blackberry does when you pound it and it doesn't fall. That's what he said, folks. And then we pop it into the freezer for six hours. Six hours. And through the magic of television, we just happen <gasps> to have some frozen oh delights my, right here. Oh me. Sadly, these blackberries did not maintain their vigor. You it's okay, say. but the nip sure did. <laughs> Do I just bite it? Yeah, just, well, don't eat the paper though, actually. Okay, no paper. No. Just all, and so here we go. You, I, I'm you know so what, excited. I want to bite yours after you bite it. Oh, God. Don't drop it, oh my Atlanta. Look at that. Oh, <laughs> I'm so excited. That is so damn good. Get your own. <laughs> I'm not caring. Oh. So sad, these. It tastes like ice cream. These are amazing. Tell me the full name of this again. It's the Look Great Naked Frozen Yogurt, yogurt cupcakes. cupcakes. That's a mouthful. You guys, can we please? Oh, you can see the honey still on the bottom and it tastes like ice cream and this is healthy, so perfect. You can eat ice cream and be hot, guys. What more do you want? Thanks for tuning in. Be sure to like and subscribe and we'll see you on our next channel.